Hey fellow officers, welcome back to the channel again. We're going to be doing some more GTA 5 police mod. Got a real nice special episode for you. I haven't done this in a couple of months. We're going to be doing a bait car series. Uh, at least for today's episode anyway. I've had uh, several people actually want me to do the bait car. And I decided to go ahead and throw one up. It's been a couple of months since we did this. So we're going to have some fun here in downtown Vinewood. So this is where these kind of vehicles belong right here. So we're going to start off... Uh, let's start off with, with just a good old-fashioned adder. So that way we'll have it uh, brought to us right over here by an uh, undercover agent. Here he is. Nice suit. Thank you, sir. So we are going to take this vehicle right here. And try not to wreck it. And then we're going to park it right down here. Let's park it right over here. Try not to lose sight of my undercover unit back there. Let's park it right here. And then we're going to leave it running, of course. And we're going to get in our uh, undercover vehicle back over here. And if you're not familiar with bait car and how it works is we wait for a, a potential criminal or a thief to come in take our adder and it's uh, got a kill switch embedded into the vehicle so that way I can actually kill the engine anytime I want and then uh, we'll pull the the actual potential thief out of the vehicle and then have them arrested so it's a pretty simple concept and uh, this is a real life thing that they do in real life they uh, they tend to they tend to do a uh, actual bait car in real life. You can go and go to YouTube and type in bait car, and you will see what I'm talking about. It is a real life thing. It is a uh, hilarious because people come out with all kinds of uh, they come up with all kinds of excuses to take the car. Someone gave them the keys. Someone asked them to park it. I mean, it is crazy the the amount of stories that people think up. So here's our potential thief. Uh, I think this is going to be him. He's going to be in blue jean shorts and a black t-shirt. White male approaching the vehicle right now. Oh, yeah. And we're on downtown Vinewood. And he is getting in our vehicle and he's taking off. So we're going to go ahead and uh, tag this guy. And he just took... No, actually he's going straight. Still going downtown Vinewood. Now I can kill this engine anytime I want to. So actually I'm going to go ahead and kill it now because he is in pursuit. I don't think so, buddy. Get out of that car. You get out of there. Hands up. Get down. Okay. He is under arrest. That was a pretty uh, simple procedure there. Sometimes they do like to try to run pretty fast. And I have to always remember they're in a pretty fast vehicle. So here you come with me, sir. And we're going to go ahead and get him in our... Actually, before I get him in there, I want to pat him down a little bit. Make sure he doesn't have anything. Okay. You get in here, sir. Okay, and then uh, what we're going to do is clean up this bait car here. Requesting pickup. We've got a 1099 in downtown Vinewood. Okay, I've got a perfect spot for the actual bait car. And I uh, see a some uh, taxi cabs taking up my spot over there. That's all right. We'll figure it out. But this is a perfect spot right over here in this alleyway. So let's do this. Let's get a uh, let's get a good old fashioned Teresa more in here, man. These things are these things are badass. Okay, it's coming down uh, downtown Vinewood right now. Here it comes. Sweet as hell, man. Look at that. That's right. Oh my. 
Thank you, sir. All right, we're going to park it right over here so it don't have a lot of... Uh, we're going to park it like right back here. Right here. And then we're going to actually take our vehicle. And I would like to move it. And I have a feeling they're probably going to take a right. So let's move our vehicle. Let's just move it over here again. Kind of like the same spot. Now it's pretty far out of the way. We're just going to keep an eye on our vehicle right here. There's a good chance I'm not going to be able to see who takes it, but that's okay. Because it's built in with an automatic uh, track, tracking device as well. GPS and I can also get an alert when someone gets in it but we're definitely out of sight I have a feeling we have a potential car thief right now that's taking off in our vehicle yep here we go there they go I do you believe it was a female wearing a maroon looking shirt We're going to wait for her to uh, get through the light here, and then we'll kill it, make it a little bit more interesting. Okay, now watch this. We're going to kill the engine. Okay, that engine's dead now. They cannot, they cannot move. <laughs> That's my vehicle, sir. Okay, get out of there. I thought it was a female. I was almost right about the maroon shirt. Alright, get down. Okay. I think that was your car? Huh? You get back over here. Okay, and then uh, I'm going to frisk him real fast, see if he's got anything good. Yeah, it's a pretty simple uh, concept. If you guys like doing these kind of bait cars yourself, it's uh, actually pretty fun. It's a lot of fun. And you can uh, switch it up any way you want. You don't have to make it real fancy cars. They can be, you know, just regular cars like the ones behind me back over there. You know, they don't have to be this. You can go back in the I&I &I and name it anything you want. Just make sure it's all capital letters and make sure it's the correct vehicle in the I&I &I in the bait car. Uh, this whole time I've been talking to actually the guy sitting on the ground, not you as a viewer, I'm just saying. Backup needed for a suspect placed under arrest in Hollywood. I was telling him how to play GTA. What do you What are you thinking? What do you think you're going to do? What do you think? You think you're going to actually get in there? Okay. Making sure. Just making sure. Okay. Here comes his ride, and then uh, we'll have to have our bait car towed away, so. AKA, make it vanish. Okay, and here's his ride right there. And uh, let's get back up here again. I like the, uh, the Vinewood Boulevard again. Downtown Vinewood Hill. And let's keep going, right? And uh, let's see here. I'm thinking maybe an area back in here, huh? Yeah, this looks good. This is a really good bait car area right here. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay. Oh, come on, man. You can get out of the way. Okay, let's get, uh, let's see, what shall we do today here, guys? I feel like I'm actually talking to you like you're in here with me. Oh, uh, yeah, you can't ever beat a good old Infernus down here in uh, Vinewood area. So here comes an Infernus. 
And like I said, you can name these uh, anything you want. You can have, you know, station wagon pull up if you want. Those wouldn't be bad if you did, did them up north, you know, somewhere near in the sheriff's department or something. Thank you, sir. Where to put this thing? Where to put this thing? I'm thinking in this little... Damn, this thing's fast. Couldn't resist, sorry. Let's see, we want to make it to where they only go out one area. So I want them to come out. I want them to come out right here. We paid eight million for that fucking yacht. And let's get them, uh, let's leave the door open. <laughs> Make it real easy, right? Okay, and then we need to get out of sight. I got a perfect little area back over here. Park right over here. There we go. How about that? Perfect. Okay. So now we're going to sit here and wait for someone to take our in furnace. Looks like we have our first suspect here, and they are getting in the bait car as we speak. So let's go ahead and get them. What's happening? Hope you appreciate the dash cam too. Something a little different, right? Okay, and let's go ahead and light this person up, and I, I love to, to actually play with these guys a little bit. I like to play with my dinner before I eat it. So we'll wait just a second here, and then we'll pull him over, shall we? So we can have a little fun so we can question him a little bit. Sounds like they got a uh, nice shootout going on over there. Right. Light them up. Is you actually getting stopped? Okay. Now you stop right there. Ocean 21, show me at a traffic stop, Alta Street, with bait car. 10 4, copy that. Let's go up and talk to this guy. Right to woman. Hello, how are you doing today? Well, the reason why I pulled you over, you have a uh, tail light out. Can I see your license and registration, please? Thank you. This is a nice car you have here, Mrs. Rivera. One second. I said I'd like to play with my dinner before I eat it. Oh, good luck, darling. Let's party soon. Okay, well, make sure you get that traffic, uh, your actual brake light fixed. And uh, one other thing here, let me uh, see here. If you don't mind, could you step out of the vehicle just for a second? One small problem. Get your hands behind your back. This vehicle is not yours and you know it. Get over here. Go ahead and frisk her stupid ass. Okay. Requesting transport Alta Street. No way. We have backup needed in downtown Vinewood. Okay, you get back over here, and you get in my vehicle. This is a bait car, ma'am. Hey. 
you're gonna be on national TV. Just letting you know that. Loser. She is a loser. Okay. Hmm. What we're probably gonna have to do. Let's go ahead and uh, we'll just go ahead and have them pick up the bait car, and then uh, we'll just get us another one. See ya. See ya. We'll get us another one, and I think I spot another good spot for a bait car. Hopefully I'm giving you some good ideas. And I'm pretty sure you can actually do a bait car with the motorcycle. I have not done that yet. I think I might do that in, a, in another episode. You guys let me know if that does work. Uh, what shall we do here? Uh, yeah, let's do a... Uh, Let's do a bullet. I like bullets. Anyway, you guys, I hope you like these kind of episodes. Make sure you share the video, okay? Because uh, it really helps my channel to grow. Uh, simply liking the video, I obviously want you to do that and make comments and those kinds of things. Let me know what you think about these kind of episodes. But sharing the videos by far really helps my channel grow. I've seen um, a pretty good increase in numbers with people sharing the videos, so I do appreciate you guys. All right, there's a nice little bullet right here. I don't want to get in mine. It is a nice car, and the person that's going to take it is going to think it's nice too. And we're going to park it right in here in this kind of crap hole right here. And we'll just close the door, why not? It doesn't really matter. I'm trying to think of a good spot where we can uh, park our car. And I'm trying to guess what they'll probably... They'll probably take a right. Which means they'll probably be a right out of here. And that means we'll probably just pull right here. Right here, and we'll just wait for them to... Uh, hopefully take a right. Now they could take a left but uh, something makes me think they'll take a right. And uh, definitely wanted to start doing more day episodes in case you've been noticing a lot lately. I've been doing a lot of episodes during the day and that's simply because I really did not realize that mobile devices you know we're not picking up night episodes as well as say you know a PC or something like that or if you're watching it on TV you know these kind of episodes and so my apologies to all the people out there watching these on the cell phones that were trying to watch night episodes damn I didn't know it was so bad I went back and watched one of my own episodes with my uh, galaxy uh, and I could not get over how dark it was. I was like, this is crazy. So I don't think I'll be making a lot of night episodes anymore. So mostly day, and today's pretty, you know, clear. Uh, sometimes I'll throw up some different uh, weather effects in here. But I thought I would do a pretty just sunny episode during the daytime so y'all can see pretty good. See you Hi. Okay, looks like we got our first person right there looks like she's checking things out and she went in there so I have a feeling she's gonna take that bait car it's a female kind of a gray shirt shorts she is taking it and she's smashing the hell out of my bait car here she goes and she is taking that right good here she is And I am in an unmarked unit, so she may not know that I'm back here yet. And once again, this is a bullet. And you can see the uh, license plate pretty damn good with this dash cam. I like it. But it doesn't really matter because this is our vehicle. Look at the guy who's going to take a picture. Look at her head. Man, bitch. Take my car like that. 
Okay, once again, I think y'all might have got a kick out of the, the last person we pulled over, right? So let's do it again, right? Let's go ahead and light her up. Those things waiting for this uh, light. We'll make her run that red. She knows it's not her car. Motion 21, show me the traffic stop, Clinton Avenue, bait car. Roger that. Okay, we are in Clinton Avenue right here. And we're going to go up and talk to the suspect and see if they're willing to talk. Yep, gray shirt, dark hair. It's like Caucasian female. Hello, ma'am. Yeah, I noticed that you uh, actually you know, performed an illegal right-hand turn back over there. Let's see your license and registration, please. This is a nice vehicle, by the way. What kind of color would you call this? Charcoal gray or black? Carbon still? Black? Okay, thanks. One second, Jackie. Okay, she's got a suspended license. Not that it matters. <laughs> okay, once again, you performed an illegal turn back there, so we're going to give you a si Wait a second. Um, actually, let's have you do one more thing. Let's have you step out of that vehicle. And one more last thing. Put your hands behind your back. You dumbass. You know this is not your car. Nice shorts. Get back over here. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, do a nice little pat down on this young lady, if you know what I mean. Am I if I pat you down? Okay, thanks a lot. Nah, I'm not very interested. According to my character, it says nothing of interest. Okay, you sit down. And you're getting a ticket for a suspended license, too. 321 requesting transport Clinton Avenue. We have assistance required in downtown Vinewood. Hello. Okay, here comes her ride. So what you with making item money? Okay, guys. Jack is going to go for a ride in the back there. I hope you enjoyed today's episode. I really do appreciate your patronage for stopping back by the channel. And uh, we'll do this again. If you like these kind of episodes, make sure you smash that like button and share the videos, guys. That really does help me grow. And thank you guys for visiting the Benzo Effect channel, guys. Come back again for another effect. Take care.